This video is going to show you how to jailbreak and unlock the iPhone 3GS on firmware 4.3 using Snowbreeze and UltraSnow. If you have the iPhone 3GS with an old boot ROM, then this jailbreak is untethered. If you have the iPhone 3GS with the new boot ROM, then this jailbreak is tethered. First, you will need to download two files from the video description. Once you have done that, run Snowbreeze. Then click Next. Then select the firmware file that was downloaded and select the correct one for your device. If you have the iPhone 3GS, then a pop-up menu will come up and select if you have the old boot ROM or the new boot ROM. If you don't know which one you have, select Detect It For Me. If you have the old one, it will be an untethered jailbreak. If you have the new one, then it will be a tethered jailbreak. Then click Expert Mode, click Build IPSW. And then wait about 3 to 5 minutes while it creates the IPSW. Then once it's done creating the IPSW, click OK. Then turn off your device. and then click start press the home and power buttons for 10 seconds then release the power button but keep holding the home button and now your device is in DFU mode. Then click OK. Then you can exit Snowbreeze and now open iTunes. Now it will say that iTunes has detected a device in recovery mode. Click OK. Then shift click on restore and select the Snowbreeze IPSW file that was created. And the file name should start with Snowbreeze. Then click open. Now iTunes has finished restoring the device and it's now booting back up. And now your device will be jailbroken on firmware 4.3. Firmware version 4.3 and Cydia is installed. Now to unlock your iPhone, go to Cydia. In order for UltraSnow to successfully unlock your iPhone, you will need to be on one of six baseband versions. Those six baseband versions are listed in the video description. And then tap on Manage. Tap on Sources. And click on the Ultra Snow source. Then tap on Ultra Snow. And then tap Install. And then click Confirm. Then click Restart Springboard. Now once UltraSnow is installed, you can insert your SIM card. So I'm going to insert my T-Mobile SIM. And now you can see T-Mobile at the top, and the device is unlocked on firmware 4.3.